My name is Mike Anaclerio. I'm a high school teacher in the south suburbs of Chicago. My oldest sister, Mary, had autism. She was diagnosed in 1974. Mary was very unique. She had an excellent memory. Mary's first thing when she met strangers was to ask their birthday, which was, and went into her mental uh, Rolodex along with their parents' names. She always wanted to know. 2003, Chicago Cubs were in the playoffs and they were playing the Florida Marlins. And in game six, the Cubs ended up blowing the lead, losing the game. It was me and Mary in the house together. My mom was working. I thought the world was going to end because the Cubs didn't win and didn't go to the World Series. And she reached up with her arm on my shoulder like she always did when she wanted my attention. And she said, what are we doing for lunch today? Mary always kept things in perspective and I knew things were going to be okay. I knew that life was going to go on even though that the Cubs did not go to the World Series that me and Mary were going to go get lunch. So it was August of 2011. I was walking into the locker room to get changed to go out to practice. My mom called me on my phone and said, I'm on my way to take Mary to the hospital. I said, what's wrong? She had uh, stage four colon cancer and uh, they said six months to a year. I start every class, every semester, every year talking about her and how it is important to help others. Do not look down on somebody with disabilities. A buddy of mine who lives down the street and is a teacher at the other school in my district, he came up with this idea that uh, for our football game, since we're both football coaches as well, when we play each other, which is a rivalry that uh, will turn it into a fundraiser for uh, autism awareness. We were gonna sell t-shirts to both student bodies and the faculty, and if they wore the t-shirt to the game, they got it for free. And we ended up selling 500 t-shirts. I originally ordered 200. And when it was all said and done, we raised over about $7,000. My mom brought up the idea to me and Beth that she was gonna get a tattoo to remember Mary by. So she got her tattoo to remember Mary. My sister got um, Mary's initials on her wrist. And I said, you know, I, I got these cards that Mary signed her name on. And I said, I have her state ID too. I said, I want the autism puzzle piece on my chest, over my heart, with how she wrote her name. She taught me so many lessons that I don't think I would have learned without her. I want my sons, Benjamin and Dominic, to know how important their aunt was, that she wasn't just another person um, she wasn't just a person with autism, what an impact she made on this family and the people around her and how important she is to be remembered.